Pornography is easier to access than ever. Thanks to the proliferation of the internet, explicit videos and images are now no more than a few key taps away. It's no surprise then that studies show most of us have seen pornography of some form at least once. There are some of us, however, that can't seem to get enough and consume it for several hours a week. Some of the common damaging effects of pornography can include addiction, isolation, increased aggression and distorted beliefs and perceptions about relationships and sexuality. These negative consequences don't usually stay just in the porn zone. It can also make you feel pretty crappy about yourself and make you ignore important areas of your life. Studies have found that people with compulsive sexual behavior show different patterns of brain activity when viewing erotic images compared to healthy controls. These are similar patterns to those seen in drug abuse. So could pornography actually be harming us? Being sexually disciplined is a cheat code for winning across life, with women, with your family, with money and with motivation. Today, we are going to walk you through a seven-step process to desexualize your brain and become more focused, proactive, and sexually disciplined. Number one, self-worth. When people become overly obsessed with pursuing others, especially romantically and sexually, they often lose sight of their intrinsic value. From an evolutionary perspective, men who exude confidence and self-control are more appealing to women. It's not about conforming to societal standards of attractiveness, Instead, it's about embodying qualities that contribute to survival and the well-being of potential offspring. By recognizing your worth, you gain a unique advantage in relationships. Desperation, neediness, and obsession are unattractive traits that can repel potential partners. Being the prize means having standards and not settling for anything less than a healthy, reciprocal connection. This mindset shift sets the foundation for a journey towards sexual discipline as it involves regaining control over personal desires and understanding that true attraction stems from a position of strength and self-assurance. As you embrace this idea, the focus shifts from constantly seeking validation from external sources to cultivating internal self-worth. This shift allows for a more authentic connection with others, unclouded by the pressures of societal expectations. It's about becoming the best version of yourself, not for the approval of others, but for personal fulfillment and the establishment of healthier, more meaningful relationships. Being obsessed with women makes you desperate, which is worse than being ugly or lower status from an evolutionary standpoint. Start your sexual discipline journey by quitting pornography. Number two. Realize the importance of quitting porn. Quitting pornography involves understanding the profound impact it has on both mental and emotional well-being. Consuming pornography has been linked to lower sexual desire and satisfaction, creating a cycle that hinders personal development. It is not merely a matter of abstaining, but acknowledging the need for a huge positive lifestyle change. Quitting porn is not a standalone solution. It is a catalyst for broader self-improvement. It requires addressing the underlying factors that lead to its consumption. This often involves a reassessment of personal habits, triggers, and coping mechanisms. Research also highlights the positive aspects of quitting porn. The brain's neuroplasticity allows it to rewire and recover from the effects of consistent exposure to explicit material. As individuals cease consuming pornography, they experience a reversal of the negative side effects leading to heightened sexual desire and satisfaction. Acknowledging the challenge and seeking help from communities, therapists, or support groups can significantly contribute to a successful transition away from explicit content. This step towards sexual discipline is not just about abstaining from a particular behavior. It is a holistic approach to fostering mental, emotional, and interpersonal well-being. Number three, save time and get rich. Invest the time spent on porn and dating apps into improving yourself. Consider redirecting that energy towards personal growth, skill acquisition and financial success. By redirecting focus to your personal development, you can leverage time more effectively, creating a foundation for more productive activities and lasting success. Consuming pornography excessively can have serious negative effects on mental health, contributing to issues like anxiety, depression and decreased self-esteem. Shifting focus towards mindful activities promotes a positive mindset, self-confidence, and overall well-being. Investing time in pursuing passions, setting and achieving goals, leads to a continuous personal growth. 
This growth extends beyond immediate gratification, providing a sense of fulfillment and accomplishment over the long term, helping in building a strong foundation for the future, whether it's through education, entrepreneurship, or career advancement. These efforts contribute to a more secure and prosperous life. This strategic approach is also grounded in the understanding that personal growth is an attractive quality. Engaging in activities that enhance your capabilities not only adds value to your own life, but also makes you more intriguing and appealing to potential partners. This shift from a pursuit focused solely on external validation to one centered on internal enrichment holds the key to saving time and fostering long-term success in all areas of life. In essence, the mantra, save time and get rich, takes on a multifaceted meaning, encompassing not only financial prosperity, but also the richness that comes from personal development. By reframing the pursuit of love as a byproduct of a well-rounded and enriched existence, people can break free from the cycle of exhausting and costly pursuits, ultimately achieving a more comprehensive and sustainable form of success. Number four, stop going on social media for porn. Avoid social media platforms for pornography. Any sexually stimulating content, including pictures, audio, or videos, is considered pornography. Cut the problem at its source and redirect your focus. The digital era has brought with it new challenges to maintaining sexual discipline, with platforms like TikTok becoming potential sources of explicit content. The recommendation to stop using social media for such purposes extends beyond the immediate act of consuming explicit material. It delves into the broader impact on motivation and mental well-being. Social media platforms often serve as escapism, offering short-term pleasure at the expense of long-term goals. Such activities can contribute to a detrimental cycle of procrastination and diminished motivation. The accessibility of explicit material on social media can create a habit of seeking instant gratification, diverting attention from more meaningful pursuits. Breaking free from this cycle is integral to regaining control over your time and energy. Replacing the consumption of explicit content with audiobooks or podcasts underscores the transformative power of content consumption. Ceasing the search for explicit content on these social platforms is not just about eliminating a specific behavior, it's a strategic move to reclaim time, focus, and mental clarity. It aligns with the broader goal of cultivating habits that support long-term success and personal development. By making intentional choices about content consumption, you can redirect your energy towards pursuits that align with your values and contribute to a more fulfilling life. Number five, exercise to control impulses. Strenuous exercise lowers sex drive and enhances self-control while it builds a better body, boosting your confidence. Incorporating exercise as a means to control impulses involves recognizing the intimate connection between physical activity and sexual drive. Studies highlight the potential benefits of redirecting energy towards physical fitness. Exercise serves as a constructive release for excess energy, providing a healthy way to channel physical and emotional tension. By incorporating regular and intense physical activity into your routine, you can experience a reduction in persistent feelings of heightened sexual arousal. This not only supports sexual discipline, but also contributes to improved mental strength, cultivating a balanced and healthy lifestyle, as physical fitness is closely linked to emotional resilience and stress management. Strenuous exercise promotes self-discipline in various aspects fostering a sense of control and resilience that extends beyond the immediate challenge of managing sexual desires. It aligns with the broader goal of creating a lifestyle that supports both physical and mental strength, ultimately contributing to a more fulfilling and disciplined life. Number six, learn to love doing hard things. Learning to love doing hard things delves into the psychology of delayed gratification and the transformative power it holds. Overcoming the habit of porn consumption presents an opportunity for individuals to cultivate mental strength and resilience. The notion that conquering this challenge can serve as a foundation for overcoming other obstacles in life underscores the broader impact of mastering self-discipline. The difficulty of breaking free from the grip of prolonged porn consumption lies not only in the act itself, but in the mental and emotional strength required to resist the instant gratification it offers. Learning to love doing hard things involves a shift in mindset, where you recognize the long-term benefits of enduring temporary discomfort. It is an acknowledgement that true growth and self-improvement often come from tackling challenges that test your limits and require sustained effort. 
Overcoming this challenge can pave the way for conquering other life obstacles. The resilience built through mastering sexual discipline can permeate various facets of life, empowering you to confront challenges with a newfound sense of confidence. It becomes a foundational skill that not only shapes how you navigate through your sexuality, but also influences your approach to challenges in education, career, and personal relationships. The call to learn to love doing hard things transcends the specific context of overcoming porn consumption. It is an invitation to embrace challenges as opportunities for growth and self-empowerment, fostering a mindset that values long-term gains over fleeting pleasures. By mastering the art of tackling difficult tasks, you lay the groundwork for a more resilient, disciplined, and fulfilling life. 7. Learn to love correctly. The final step in the process of desexualizing the brain focuses on the idea of learning to love the right way. This goes beyond the immediate context of sexual discipline and extends into the realm of building meaningful and lasting connections. The guidance here is to emphasize the importance of individuals who embody success, healthy relationships, and family values. It challenges the notion that a successful life is defined solely by the quantity of sexual encounters and redirects attention to the quality and depth of genuine connections. Look beyond superficial measures of success and question societal narratives that prioritize quantity over quality in matters of sexual connections. By emphasizing the importance of learning from those who have navigated successful, committed relationships, people are urged to prioritize wisdom over societal pressures. The mention of scientific studies linking long-term happiness to a lower number of sexual partners challenges the prevalent cultural narrative around promiscuity. It invites people to reevaluate their beliefs about love and relationship, fostering a mindset that values meaningful connections over fleeting encounters. By cultivating a disciplined approach to love, you position yourself to enjoy the emotional, psychological, and social benefits that come with a deep, meaningful, and committed relationship. In essence, the concept of learning to love correctly serves as a transformative philosophy that extends beyond sexual discipline. It encourages people to redefine their understanding of success in love and relationships, emphasizing the role of wisdom, commitment, and genuine connections in creating a fulfilling and meaningful life. This shift in perspective aligns with the overarching theme of the entire process, that true discipline and success emerge from intentional choices that contribute to a holistic and purposeful existence. Being sexually disciplined makes you more motivated and attractive. It allows you to connect with the right person and enjoy love. Avoid letting misguided influences lead you astray. Quality connections lead to long-term happiness. Follow the success sequence, finish school, manage to have a respectful income, find love, and avoid getting pregnant outside of marriage. If you enjoy this video, please give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe for more.